most essential learning competencies. Determine the number of protons, neutrons, and electrons in a particular atom. What is ion? An ion is a charged atom or molecule. It is charged when the number of electrons isn't equal with the number of protons in the atom or molecule. Last time, we differentiate what is atom and molecule. An atom is a single particle that can't be broken down by chemical reaction. Atoms join together to form molecule. Only non-metal can bond together to form molecules in a chemical bond. An ion is an atom that has either lost or gained electrons. There are two types of ions, cations and anions. All atoms have a neutral charge because they have an equal amount of protons and electrons. But, when an atom loses one or more electrons, it becomes positively charged ions and this type of ions are called cations. But when an atom gains one or more electrons, it becomes a negatively charged ion and this type of ions are called anions. How do atoms lose or gain electrons? In an atom, electrons orbit around a nucleus. The valence electrons are the electrons found in the outermost shell of an atom. These are the electrons that are lost or gained in the process of forming ions. The elements in the periodic table are arranged according to the increasing atomic number. The rows are called periods and the columns are called groups. Group number in the periodic table gives us the number of valence electrons in its outermost energy shell. How did it become an ion? Let's take a look at the periodic table of elements. Metal atoms and non-metal atoms go in opposite direction when they ionize. Metal atoms lose the electron or electrons in their highest energy level and become positively charged ions. While non-metal atoms gain an electron or electrons from another atom to become negatively charged ions. The process of an atom becoming an ion is called ionization. Again, positive ion or cation occurs when an atom loses an electron. They have more protons than electrons. Example, positively charged sodium and aluminum ions. While negative ion or an ion occurs when an atom gains an electron. They have more electrons than protons. Example, negatively charged oxide and chloride ions. How to determine number of protons, neutrons, and electrons in positive ions and in negative ions? A neutral atom has the same number of protons and electrons. A positively charged ion called cation has more protons than electrons. The proton number is the atomic number of element, while the electron number is the atomic number minus the charge. A negatively charged ion called anion has more electrons than protons. Again, the number of protons is equal to the atomic number. The number of electrons is the atomic number minus the charge. To get the number of neutrons, subtract the atomic number from the mass number. Let's have an example. Calcium ion. Atomic number is 20. And mass number is 40. 
Since the atomic number is the same with the number of protons, therefore, protons is also 20. How about the neutron? To get the number of neutron, subtract the atomic number from the mass number. 40 minus 20 equals 20. How about the electrons? In solving electrons, electrons equals the atomic number minus the charge. In this case, we have two positive charge. Therefore, 20 minus positive 2 equals 18. Let's have another example. Phosphorus ion. The atomic number of phosphorus is 15 with a mass number of 31. Again, the atomic number is the same with the number of protons. That is why the protons is also 15. In getting the number of neutrons, subtract the atomic number from the mass number. 31 minus 15 equals 16. Neutrons is 16. In getting the neutrons, electrons equals atomic number minus the charge. Therefore, 15 minus negative 3 equals 18. Can you answer this one? How about this one? Let's summarize our lesson. Ion is an atom or group of atoms that have a charge. They get a charge when the number of protons and electrons don't balance out. More protons than electrons. You will have an ion with a positive charge known as cation. Or more electrons than protons. You will have an ion with a negative charge and known as an ion.